Theatre 5 is open. This used to be a storeroom and a break room. Now it will see knee and hip operations and deal with emergencies. But is it ready to go? It's, it's ready to go right now. <laughs> Hopefully we won't have to use it immediately. Uh, and we're working on rosters, etc. to make sure it's well manned and we have uh, adequate staffing in place. Um, but as far as equipment goes, um, and plans for, for, for getting, getting ball rolling with using it, it's absolutely ready to go. As part of the new surgical strategy, the GHA says this extra capacity will make it possible to have an uninterrupted orthopaedic list running every day of the week and help reduce waiting lists substantially. So operations will be things like uh, total knee replacement, total hip replacement, emergency sections. So when babies want to come out sooner than we anticipate and they need to come out soon, they will come in here. If we have a road traffic accident and there's a trauma or somebody's had something that's broken, again, they will come in to have that fixed. So that's the kind of stuff that we'll be doing. We'll be doing breast surgery, we'll be doing urology surgery. So that's looking at the waterworks and doing all different procedures with that. So it's, it is very good indeed. Dr. Patrick Gagan told us there was a call for it. Yes, there was a call. I mean, obviously what we want to do is reduce waiting times. And when I came and I was looking at waiting times, I thought, well, how are we going to reduce it? You only can do so much work on a daily basis in any one theatre. And as we had this fantastic facility, although it was a storeroom before that, a coffee room, we emptied out all the rubbish, created this large space. And I'm really delighted, as you see for itself, it's one of the best theatres I've been in. I have to thank our staff. We have some magnificent start in our building department, in our electrical department. This was a real Team GHA effort. And I think every one of them should be applauded because what they're doing is giving a better chance for people in Gibraltar to get healthcare quicker. The government says the new theatre will improve the speed and quality of services locally. The main takeaway from the opening was reducing waiting times. I think this is an example for me. The GHA often gets criticised for spending, particularly in the budget sessions the last 10 days or so. This is the example of the GHA delivering real value for money to our community. This used to be a storeroom, used to be a coffee room. It's now a fifth operating theatre at a cost of £60,000 incredible value for money and that's going to help the community to have shorter waiting times for their operations because it'll enable us to keep going with emergency and trauma and not upset the calendar of elective surgery which happens unfortunately too often. So this is a, a, a real attempt to shorten the waiting times for elective surgeries and I have no doubt that uh, the GHA will get there. I'm very grateful to them for having done this. Making it official, a plaque was then unveiled by the Minister for Health, Director General of the GHA and the accompanying dignitaries. Theatre 5 is open for business.